Hey guys, I'm Josiah and today we're going to talk about Captain Marvel and the excuses are already starting for the box office drop in Captain Marvel. Do you remember when Solo came out and people were, all the media sites were making excuses for why the movie was failing? And yeah, it looks like we're going to get the same thing with Captain Marvel. People are going to be making up excuses for why this film is not going to do as well as it did. It's not because of the the female empowerment and the, the activist messages and all that stuff in the film. It's because, let's see, what, what are some of the excuses we got here? Um, Captain Marvel is projected to open to a solid 100 million opening weekend with a possibility of surpassing that figure. This movie is going to be so, so good. So here are some of the excuses. Captain Marvel may not have the advantage of a character like Black Panther, whose introduction was brought on by another guaranteed moneymaker, Captain America Civil War. The more comparative character is Wonder Woman, though she appeared in Batman v Superman Dawn of Justice before her solo de debut film. Batman v Superman was nowhere near as successful as Infinity War was, and we got a teaser for Captain Marvel at the end of Infinity War. However, Captain Marvel fans have been made well aware of the character's presence for some time now, following the cliffhanger at the end of Avengers Infinity War and the news that Captain Marvel would play a crucial role in Avengers Endgame. No, God, please, no, no, no. No! Carol Danvers and her superhuman counterpart are likely to drive just as much interest to the theater, at least to see how the events of the upcoming fourth Avengers movie will pan out. Yeah, well, when you have a movie that was supposed to be making like 180 million opening weekend, and now it's like down to like 80 to 100 million, yeah, I think the interest for this movie is dying, people. And then we have here an article from The Mary Sue, which is one of the cringiest sites I've ever seen in my entire life. This site actually makes me just want to rip my hair out and scream, but they provide me with interesting content and I'm actually going to be using the Mary Sue more often because they are full of the cringe and I love to make fun of the people who have the cringe. So let's see what we have here. Great opening headline we have here. Sorry haters, Captain Marvel is on track for heroic box office numbers. Heroic, huh? Down 80 million from what the the initial estimates were. Hmm. But it's still heroic, yeah. Sorry, not sorry, to those of you who are hoping that Captain Marvel might flop, but according to The Hollywood Reporter, the film is on track to do incredibly well at the box office. Yeah, sure, you, you can keep believing that if you want to. I definitely don't think it's going to be making 100 million. The site is reporting that it's headed toward a 100 million plus opening in North America, pulling numbers similar to Wonder Woman's opening weekend, 103 million. Yeah, there's no way this movie is going to be making the same as Wonder Woman did in its opening weekend. Not even, no, there's no way. Oh, and then we have here, best news of the day, Captain Marvel tracking to open at 100 million. Yeah. <laughs> These people are already just making me cringe so much. They are trying to make this movie sound like it is going to be a huge phenomenon, a big success. It's going to shatter records. The funny thing is, I was actually talking about Odin the other day about this. Odin from Odin's movie blog. And he was like, there, there actually aren't any records that they could break with this movie. Because, you know, they like to spin these movies as record breaking and stuff like they find the stupidest things to say that that it's breaking records for and stuff like the only thing that they could actually say about this it broke records for like the highest grossing movie of march 8th or whatever knowing them they're gonna spin this so that they can use that and somehow for this film so so yeah only time will tell what Captain Marvel's overall gross will be, but I assume it will probably make similar numbers to Wonder Woman and be one of Marvel's top gross grossing origin films, which is what it deserves. Yeah, there's no way this movie is going to make the same amount of money that Wonder Woman does. At least not opening weekend, and I think that word of mouth is not going to be as good for this film as, as it was for Wonder Woman. There's no way, I can't see this movie making the same amount that Wonder Woman made. 
But let's go ahead and see what the Hollywood Reporter says about it. See if they have any excuses for us here since, uh, since yeah, that's what, what they tagged here. Captain Marvel is set to bow three weeks from now on March 8th. Rival studios with access to tracking say metrics for the film are giant, including unaided awareness and definite interest. Definite interest, huh? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm sure all the white men out there are just so interested in this movie. I'm sure all of the white men are, are just dying to see this movie starring a hater of white men. I'm sure they're just so excited. They're all ready to just tuck it and just go into the theater and just sit down with their, their I don't know, soy popcorn. <laughs> and, <laughs> and they're just, they're just waiting to see this, this female empowerment on the screen. Yeah. We just can't wait for this movie. This is this is the movie that's going to save womankind. The excuses for this movie are already starting, and they're just gonna get more crazy, more convoluted as we get closer to the the movie coming out. I don't see this movie making a hundred million opening weekend. I just don't. And when that happens, oh man, prepare because there's gonna be some really juicy excuses coming out and I'm gonna be covering them and it's gonna be a fun time. So I hope you guys are looking forward to that. That will be fun to talk about. And with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and I will talk to you very soon in another video. Talk to you later, bye.